Well, here's one thing. I believe that we've seen this story a billion times, and a lot of us probably can relate to this story as well. But nonetheless, it still felt refreshing. It really, really did. Yeah, so I'm super excited. Let's jump into the review of this new film right now. What's up everybody and welcome back to the channel today for another review and today we're going to be reviewing the film Coast which will be premiering at the Bentonville Film Festival under the spotlight presentation category. Uh, this film Coast here is again uh, not a story that you have not seen before. It's definitely something that you're super familiar with. And although there's a lot of different aspects of this that is uh, very familiar and you can easily recognize from either parts of your life or from other films, it still felt very refreshing. And I think a lot had to do with it is because I feel like primarily in this situation, um, we didn't, I guess the ending wasn't as typical as we would have expected it to be. Uh, but also too, I think they really premised uh, this story to not really be just about the story, but really about the likely aspects that you can pull from out of this. And the, and the biggest thing for me is about home is where the heart is and being able to make your own choices. The free spirited, the free liberty of, of, of the human spirit. And I think that's super important. And even for 16 year old Abby Evans, who's played by uh, Fatima uh, Fatik, Fatek, I believe that's how you say her last name. Um, she's a young girl. She's definitely has what appears to be a really troubling life but she's only 16 you know at times she doesn't agree with her mom she clearly is not cool with her dad she has a group of friends that she's grown up with her entire life so they're like really cool uh, but again they're 16 they're right in their prime they're still trying to figure out life and while all these crazy opportunities are coming their way from parties from temptations and whatnot you know it's really about the struggle of uh, understanding you know what's best for her what direction in life is she willing to take and then obviously we know the love aspect comes at 16 so there's this lead uh singer of this rock band who enters her life and she's clearly head over heels for this guy and you know he throws all the typical stuff at her about how he's going to be big how they should go on tour together but also at the same time he's motivating her to really pursue her dreams and he thinks that she's talented and she could be a singer um, and maybe there is another option for her besides just education. So, you know, it's really about um, Abby being able to decide what's best for her and taking down the path um, that she's most comfortable with, along with all the different temptations, all the other suggestions and, the, and advice that's coming from all different directions. So uh, Fatima, who plays Abby, I think she does a fantastic job. Um, I'm not familiar with her work and I'm not familiar with her age. And the reason I break up her age is because this role, uh, she's so comfortable in this role, it feels very authentic because, I mean, one, we all kind of went down this type of path of our life. We all been 16. So, you know, that idea of um, how we thought we were so grown at 16 and the decisions that we made and we kind of look back at them and wish we had did things different and whatnot. Um, so we, we, there's a lot of familiarity with this, with the psychology of this character and whether she's right here in this prime now and doing so, or, you know, recently from it, you know, she put a really authentic performance that really resonate with the viewers. So you absolutely can put yourself in her shoes and understand why she made the decision she did, why she's at foes with her, her, her best friends, but then next thing you know, they're back, <laughs> uh, they're back friends. And it's all some of the other drama that they, they've been through. I mean, they, they stole a car, their parents card it without got caught like I, i've done that <laughs> I, I i i'll admit it i definitely was young and thought like oh they, we won't get caught and obviously you do get caught you know what i mean um so you know i thought she did a really good job in her lead performance here in 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 this role uh but overall again as much as this film has a lot of drama and a lot of events within this story it's truly about um, the message about really stepping out on the limb and doing what you feel is best for you Whether it comes with mistakes, whether it comes with some lessons being learned It's truly about you creating your own path regardless of what everybody says I know and that's kind of a really difficult um, Narrative to go about because you think at this age you should be listening to your parents because they're experienced and whatnot But even here we see in the story that her parents give her the liberty to decide what's best for her and you know sometimes she thinks the grass is green on the other side 
And then ultimately she discovers that home is where the heart is. And I thought that was a really powerful message because um, that's a lot of what uh, my family and what other families encompass is that no matter how far you go out into the world, you'll always have a place home here. And I, I love that. So, you know, Coast I thought is a very fantastic film for the film festival circuit, especially under the spotlight presentation category, because I feel um, in, the, in, the, in the eye of wanting to put out a really good story and tell a good message behind it, this one definitely accomplished that. And by the way, for this to be an independent film, nothing about it feels independent. I thought everyone's performance, regardless of their role, um, everybody played their position uh, really good. Um, the, the, the filmmaking aspect, cinematography, score, the musical performances was done really well as well, too. I thought that this all came together good. And you forget you're at a film festival, so most of these are independent films. So you think, like, you know, it, a, a independent film looks a certain way. You know, low budget and things could have been really tweaked and whatnot. This one didn't feel like any of that. This one just feels like a really good story. Uh, a really good film all put together back behind a good story so I, I, I won't be surprised to see this picked up very soon I think that once it does um, there is going to be a, a really good audience and, and niche for this story that 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 young teen uh, teen drama or anybody who loves like a, a, a teen love story you know they're easily going to gravitate to this and I think again uh, Fatima does a fantastic job as your lead here but yeah this is Coast again um, this will be at the uh, Bentonville Film Festival totally if you had the chance to check it out jump in the comments let me know your thoughts about this film and as always folks stay tuned because we got more reviews coming very soon thank you for watching